Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Feeling and Finding You on this windy, beautiful Thursday. Windy where I am anyway. Um, but that spring and that melts the snow, and so it's awesome. Uh, today we're going to talk about happiness is an inside job. And just about, you know, not letting anyone else's vibration alter your happiness. Uh, staying happy within you is the most important thing you can do. And uh, when you have that happiness inside and you're always connected to your alignment, to your source, to your God, um, it, nothing can really ruffle that. You're happy no matter what happens in your world, in the world around you. So. Um, it's just awesome. So um, good morning, Jen. Um, I'm going to read just a couple paragraphs out of the book, Ask and It is Given by Abraham and by Esther and Jerry Hicks. And um, I think you'll like this. And um, we'll do some fun freedom release method to help us align with that. Uh, you know, sometimes in our lives, we feel like um, if our spouse isn't happy, we're not happy, or if our kids aren't happy, we're not happy, and that we have to help make them happy. But it's an inside job. You can't do that for anybody else. It, you can only do that for yourself. And I think this will help you have a little more clarity on that and, and start to remember that, that we can't make anyone else happy. It, it, you just have to be happy yourself. And that alone, your vibration, when they see that you're happy no matter what, that'll lift their vibration more. But you can't do it for them. It's um, like one of my favorite sayings. I can explain it to you, but I can't understand it for you. <laughs> so um, just being happy yourself helps everyone around you. So good morning, Rosemary. Okay, so this paragraph is called Your Happiness Does Not Depend on What Others Do. So your happiness does not depend on what others do, but only upon your own vibrational balance. And the happiness of others does not depend on you, but only on their own vibrational balance. For the way anyone feels in any moment is only about their own mix of energies. The way you feel is simply, clearly, and always the indicator of the vibrational balance between your desires and your vibrational offering, which from your vantage point, you have launched. There is nothing in all of the universe more important for anyone to understand than how the vibration they are offering is matching the vibrations of their desires. And the way you feel is your indicator of whether you are allowing your connection to source or not. Every good feeling, every positive creation, all your abundance, clarity, health, vitality, and well-being and all the things that you consider to be good are dependent upon the way you are feeling right now and on the relationship that fe that feeling vibration has to the vibration of who you really are and what you really desire. So uh, isn't it awesome that you don't have to depend on someone else? Isn't it awesome that you alone feeling your own vibration can choose to pivot to better and better vibrations. So um, I just love that. And I, I love knowing that you are that powerful for yourself. You know, we are such amazing beings. Uh, we can be, do or have anything that you want to do, be or have. Um, you can manifest anything you want. You know, just lining up with that vibration, everything that you've ever thought about or daydreamed about or wanted, 
is right in your vortex waiting to be lined up to so that you can allow it in. And allowing is, um, you know, when we're feeling good and we're in that feel good space, we're happy, we're joyful, we're appreciative of what we have. That's when you're allowing all the other good stuff in. But when you're focusing on, you know, the things you don't want or, oh, I feel bad because the sun's not shining today or whatever it is, <laughs> um, that's bringing more of those negative emotions or the, those not so feel good emotions to come in. So um, find things that feel good every single day. Find your joy every day. Find in it, in it, you know, I've said this over and over. Um, you don't have to go from way down here to way up here in one step. Just look for little things that feel good. And, you know, it, it, they just, it creates a momentum and you'll have that inner happy all the time. So um, one thing I love to do is when I am out driving, um, I hit green lights all the time. And every time I do, I appreciate those. And I thank, you know, thank you for that green light, you know, and, and it feels good. It just makes you giggle inside because oh, I did it again. I did it again, you know, and that's, it can be something that little, that something that small to create that momentum of feel good feelings for the rest of your day. So, um, and when I hit a red light, I think to myself, okay, I need to slow down, take a breath. You know, stopping at a red light is an awesome chance to just take a couple deep breaths and align with yourself, align with that feel good feeling. So it's never a bad thing. You know, the little bumps in the road are never a bad thing. So let's do some freedom release method and align to this belief that you are in charge of your own happiness. It really is an inside job. So just take a nice deep breath, cleansing breath first. Okay, and if you haven't done Freedom Release Method with me before, it's just a simple breathing technique. You breathe in, hold your breath. I'll say a statement. You think it in your own words when I say it. And then you just breathe out and make an effort to blow that out, blow it away from you because we're releasing that. And if you feel a yawn coming or you burp or sneeze or cough or anything like that, that's your body letting go of things. That's your body releasing those unwanted beliefs, you know, so allow that to happen. Don't hold that back and I'll go slow enough so you have time to do that. And um, you know, sometimes even tears might come if it's a deep seated belief that no longer serves you. So just allow that to happen. And um, you'll feel great when we do the Phillips to replace that and to sink those new beliefs in it. It's really awesome. So okay, breathe in and hold. I release all blocks and barriers with my happiness does not depend upon others. Good morning, Tommy. Good morning, Dory. I can't see everyone that's here right now, but good morning and welcome. Okay, breathe in and hold. I release all blocks and barriers with my happiness depends on my own vibrational balance. Good. Breathe in and hold. I release all blocks and barriers with other people's happiness does not depend upon me. And that one is so, so important. We can't make anybody else happy. You know, we can talk to them, we can 
um, ask them what their desires are, what their dreams are, you know, helping them to think about that and show them what's helped us maybe or talk to them about it. Um, communication is amazing. And um, it's something that we need to bring back in the world is face-to-face -face communication. Um, and, and that is maybe the missing step, you know? Maybe someone isn't happy because they aren't having those connections. And you can't make people connect either, but you can show them how happy you are and be happy and be happy in connecting with people and that will help them find their own inner happiness um you know they have to do it on their own we all have to do it on our own it, it's you know like i said at the beginning it's an inside job um but just shining your own light helps other people see that they can shine theirs so awesome Okay, breathe in and hold. I release all blocks and barriers with I am always connected to my source, my God, my creator. Happy day, beautiful Rosemary. Good morning, Dave. Yeah, so the more you work on having that connection, the more you meditate a little bit every day, um, you know, pre-pave your day, thinking about how you want your day to go, setting your intention for the day, uh, taking those quiet moments to just take a couple deep breaths, that is connecting you to your source, to your God, to your creator, whatever you your name that you use for that, um, all knowing energy. So, uh, you know, pay attention to that and make that a priority for you to set that time aside each day. <coughs> oh, sorry, I had a sneeze coming there. <laughs> um, all is good. I love sneezes. They help you bring in life force energy. You take a deep breath. So um, awesome. Let's go on here. Uh, breathe in and hold. I release all blocks and barriers with when I feel my connection, my happiness grows. So just like I was talking about, so true. You know, when you feel that connection, because we are all connected. We are all part of that energy, part of that God force energy. You know, um, <laughs> source sneezed me. Yeah, true, Dave. <laughs> um, you know, when we are, when we remember that, that we are part of that awesome energy, it lives within us. We're all a piece of that. All of us, no matter who we are, we're a piece of that source energy and it lies and lives within us and it wants us to be happy it's you know helping us live an amazing life so okay breathe in and hold i release all blocks and barriers with i love seeing people connected to their source And that's so awesome too. That's just spreading joy. You know, when we feel joy within us, it helps other people feel joy within them. And it shows them that, yeah, it's okay to feel good. It's okay to be happy. Um, it's okay to not take life so seriously all the time. Laugh at things. Laugh. Laughter is a, an amazing thing to have in your life. Everyone should have laughter. Um, I know in, in my life, my kids are so funny and my husband, Don, too. You know, we have always had laughter in our life, no matter what's going on. We laugh about everything, laugh about, you know, it, everyday things. And, you know, if 
if you don't have that, if you have people in your life that aren't so funny or, or don't like to laugh, go to a comedy movie, go see a comedian, go um, read a funny book, read a comic, you know, anything to help help you laugh. It's awesome. Good morning, Marianne. Okay, breathe in and hold. I release all blocks and barriers with my own well-being is important to me. And really your own well-being should be one of the most important things to you. Um, it's so important that you feel good. When you feel good, you can give to others, you can help others. But when you're not feeling good, that's that's not a good time to be helping other people or doing things like that, you know? We have to fill ourselves up. We have to, um, we can't give and give and give and deplete yourself. You have to fill yourself up too. So do things that feel good to you. Okay, breathe in and hold. I release all blocks and barriers with when I'm feeling good, good things flow to me. Okay, that one is so fun. And just like the green light story that I talked about at the beginning, you know, um, once you notice that you're hitting green lights all the time or you find the perfect parking spot and appreciate that and feel good about that and um, let that be a piece of your joy, then um, more and more of that happens all the time. It's so, so fun. Good morning, Tanya. Happy to see you here. <clears throat> okay, so one more. One more release and then we'll do some Phillips. So breathe in and hold. I release all blocks and barriers with finding and feeling my effervescent joy. I love that. So, um, you know, finding little pieces of joy in your day, it, it's gonna make, a huge difference in your in your day. It just creates that momentum of feeling good and feeling good all the time. You know, even if you have a little bump in your road, you're still gonna feel good. It's not gonna knock you off your alignment um, because we can always pivot to something that feels better than the little bump made you feel. So remember that always. <clears throat> okay, so let's do some fill ups. Okay, breathe in and hold. I'm filled with love, joy, and appreciation because I know my happiness does not depend on others. Good, breathe in and hold. I'm filled with love, joy, and appreciation because my happiness depends on my own vibrational balance. And I love that. Breathe in and hold. I'm filled with love, joy, and appreciation because I know that other people's happiness is not dependent on me. Doesn't that feel good? Doesn't that take a lot of the pressure off? You know, we don't have to make other people be happy. It's their own job to do, not ours. Your job is to make you happy and look for those feel good things. Awesome. Yeah, so much freedom, Jen. Um, there is so much freedom in that, knowing that you're the only one that you have to worry about being happy. No one else. They can do it themselves. They're big boys and girls right now. <laughs> you know, they can do it. Um, and same with your kid. If 
you know, little kids watching them, they know how to find their own happy. They can do it. They do it all the time, all day long. So, okay, breathe in and hold. I'm filled with love, joy, and appreciation because I know that I am always connected to my source, my God, my creator. Breathe in and hold. I'm filled with love, joy, and appreciation because I know when I feel my connection, my happiness grows by leaps and bounds. Breathe in and hold. I'm filled with love, joy, and appreciation because I love seeing other people connected to their source. Breathe in and hold. I'm filled with love, joy, and appreciation because my own well-being is important to me. Okay, breathe in and hold. I'm filled with love, joy, and appreciation because I know when I continue to look for what feels good, it creates a momentum of feel-good feelings. Breathe in and hold. I'm filled with love, joy, and appreciation because I know the most important thing is that I feel good. Breathe in and hold. I'm filled with love, joy, and appreciation because when I'm feeling good, good things flow to me. And last one, breathe in and hold. I'm filled with love, joy, and appreciation because I know happiness is an inside job and I've got this. Awesome. I hope this helps your day. I hope you find that inner happiness and have an awesome day. And don't forget to check us out on YouTube and our website and on Instagram at Best Life Creation Society and bestlifecreationsociety.com. And you can find me at Inspired Signals on Facebook and Instagram and ins inspiredsignals.com is my website. So have an awesome day. Thank you for being you and thanks for being here. Love you. <laughs>